Okay, welcome back to Alpha 12 of Seven Days to Die. Uh, today I'm going to play around a little bit with uh, the mini bike. I'm in creative mode right now, a little bit of a cheating, but uh, I think everybody wants to see what this thing's all about. So, uh, first thing you'll need to get is you're going to need to get a copy of this book, and it's called uh, Mini Bikes for Dumb Shits. Uh, so I imagine it's a I imagine it's a pretty high level uh, drop. So you're probably not going to find it early on unless it's very very lucky. Anyway, you're going to learn that. So we'll just give that a go. So recipe unlocked, mini bike chassis. Okay, so. So it shows you how to actually make all the mini bike components if you can't find the ones you're after here. So as you can see, you can make a mini bike seat, a mini bike seat with uh, some duct tape, leather, uh, pipes, and cotton. That's fairly self-explanatory. A mini bike chassis is just a bunch of pipes. Handlebars. Uh, oh, mini bike handlebars. You will need to get the uh, just regular handlebars, and then you're sort of extending them out with a headlight, uh, some scrap cable, and uh, some duct tape. Uh, and let's see if we can actually build ourselves the mini bike now. Yeah, so how this works is you lay the mini bike down, and then when you get into the mini bike, you're given this mini bike frame, uh, this mini bike uh, screen, and you're going to start adding components to it. So, for example, I'm going to put the small engine on it. And there we go. See, we have our poor small engine. You can highlight the components individually. I'm going to put on my craptacular seat, uh, my handlebars, and then my wheels. Now you can also put a little storage basket in there. Uh, oh, we also need a battery. I should get a battery on here too then. Easy enough. So we just... I make it look much harder than it is. So we get our battery. Oop, got a little eager there. And then we're going to put our battery in. Okay, now it's a good mini bike. So right now, it's not working, and of course it's not working because you can see the fuel gauge on the bottom there, it's empty. So I have to figure out how to fuel this thing. So I push, ah, oh, there we are. So you hold E, and then you fill it full of gas, and you see we lose a fuel tank. And now, we got a mini bike! So they did change the audio slightly. The old one was really bad. Let's see if it actually changes tone. Does it go up hill or anything? Not really. Not really at all. It's definitely much faster than walking, that's for sure. And if you put the basket on the end of it, it's really gonna be pretty quick. And if you hadn't noticed already, we're also experiencing the snow, and ooh, it looks like we're turning into rain now. Oh, that was the rain. Hope you all enjoyed that. Yeah, so let's see if we can do any sweet tricks. Something we can launch over? Not exactly. So spacebar seems to be break. Now can we run through anything? So there's some cotton. Oh, there's something to launch over. We gonna line this up here. Actually, can catch air. That's kind of cool. Yeah, I'll do that one more time. Woo -hoo -hoo! Oh, oh! Now I got to do a 18-point turn to get out. 
can actually get a fair amount of fuel here, though. I don't think the gauge is going down, like, linearly. I think it just has, like, half-quarter points that it hops to. But still, you get a lot of fuel for, uh, a lot of distance for fuel, so that's good to see. So that, that audio might need a little bit more further tweaking. But yeah, there we go. There's our, uh, there's our minibike. Oh, just one more thing I thought I'd add. Uh, the only other thing you can do is to the mini bike, of course, uh, there's a storage feature to it, so if we get into it, uh, the other thing you can add is you can put a shopping basket in. And uh, the shopping basket obviously allows us to use it as storage. <laughs> that was the horn. But there we go. And so you can put in anything you like and take it for a drive. And when you get to a location, you're like, oh, look at all of the goldenrod. I'm going to pick all the goldenrod. I'm going to collect all this goldenrod and take it to where it is needed. So we just put it into the mini bike. Put it in. And there you go. So, yeah, that, that was the one other thing that needed to be shown is you need to get the basket. Because the whole point of this is that this is going to be your pack meal when you're doing the long-range the long stuff. Anyway, that's it. Hope you enjoyed this video.